dear video first year students welcome back into my another video hope you are all doing well if you are having a backlog in the subject green buildings so this video is for you here i will discuss some important questions for your makeup examinations betck 105b or 205b is it subject code so these are some important questions for your makeup examination so model wise i have taken here the important questions which i will discuss over here first of all we have in model first name the different types of uh, construction materials and explain any two of them list the types of burnt bricks and explain them in detail these may be 10 10 marks question okay as it is the theoretical subject so try to understand the concepts in your own convenient language it is not necessary to remember point to point whatever is written in your notes next we have discussed the environmental issues related to curing of uh, building materials and discuss the technical aspects of bamboo as construction materials define cost effective construction explain the importance of cost effective construction in sustainable development next we have discussed the properties of concrete blocks and their role in cost effective construction next we have how does the use of fiber reinforced polymer composites impact the sustainability of construction last question from the model first is what is gypsum board and how it is used in modern construction discuss its benefits over traditional plastering materials so coming to the model second we have here explained in detail the rat trap bond with the help of neat sketch and discuss the various aspects of ferro cement construction list and explain the different types of door and window frames and uh, discuss the advantage of using precast elements for walls and proofs uh, fifth question we have discussed the different types of substitutes for traditional wall construction explain the advantage and disadvantage of each okay next we have discussed the use of ferro cement in the construction of beams and columns how do these components enhance structural integrity what role does a nirmiti kendra play in the promotion of sustainable building techniques in india and last we have discussed the contributions of the habitat organization in creating affordable housing solutions uh, using cost effective materials and technologies as you already know uh, the syllabus is vast for the subject so it is better to go through these super important questions that is why i have taken 88 questions otherwise there is a lot of possibilities vt may ask you different type of questions over there <clears throat> So next, uh, model three, we have discussed the contribution of buildings towards global warming. Explain the global efforts to reduce carbon emission. What is a carbon footprint? Discuss the major sources of carbon emissions in the building sector. Next, we have described in detail about embodied energy in materials. Define green buildings. How do they contribute to sustainability and environmental protection? Explain the health and social benefits of green building and what is life cycle costing in construction explain how it applies to both green and conventional buildings compare the initial cost of constructing a green building versus a conventional building why might green buildings have a higher initial cost what are the economic benefits of green buildings how do they reduce operational costs over time so this is all about model third and now we have model four over here write a short note on a b r e e m bream lead and green star and griha g r i h a okay so go through these uh, important topics okay this will be 20 marks question explain the principles of sustainable development in building design discuss the cons concepts of integrated life cycle design of materials and structure uh, fourth question we have explained the purpose of implementing green building rating systems and what are the characteristics of sustainable buildings provide examples of sustainability managed materials used in green buildings and what is a green building rating system discuss the role of green building rating systems in promoting sustainability in the construction industry so these are six questions from module four now we have last module model fifth mention and explain the various utilities of solar energy in building and discuss a case study of solar passive cooled and heated buildings explain the concepts of green composites describe low energy approaches to water management in buildings how can these approaches help conserve water resources in urban environments and discuss in detail the solid waste management in building explain the role of green cover in the building environment how does it improve the sustainability of urban areas and what is uh, sludge wa water and how can it be managed in green building so this is all about model fifth if you want to pass the subject you can only focus on three modules fully if you are able to cover full syllabus from the three models then it is also possible to pass the subject but better to go through important questions of all the modules or you can go through three modules and taking two two questions 
super important questions from other two modules that is also the passing strategy for theoretical subjects so as much as possible try to fill the paper okay uh, try to fill more than 25 pages for the theoretical subjects so it becomes easy to pass these particular subjects and try to discuss the topics with your friends so that you can remember those well over the years so i wish you all the best for your examinations my dear friends make sure you will share this video to all your batchmates who are having backlogs in green building subject thank you